Fish Festival at Front Cut and everyone's eating crawfish, but I am having artichokes that were boiled in the boil. And trust me, I'm happier. Why I do these things, I don't know. And it's real human hair. Oh, that's just creepier. Oh, that is a creepy look at Oh, that's just creepy. Where do I see? Okay, there it is. Oh, wow. I'll also be wearing glasses. That always makes me happy. That's pretty well done, though. Oh, it's like $10,000. That's a sweet... Is this a, a reproduction of somebody specific? Yeah, it's one of the bandmates. Wow, that's so realistic. That's actually really scary. <laughs> the wow. skin tone is dead the on. The skin tone matches dead on. That that's could... Incredible. Yeah. What? <laughs> I can't hear you. sound like you're talking through latex. <laughs> that's incredible. Wow. Yeah, the skin tone is frightening. That's good. Good, good. It's heavy. Yeah, that's Alas, for Yorick. Yeah. And you'll be wearing these very <laughs> fragile glasses. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's creepy. I don't know if he heard you about the very fragile glasses. The very fra wrapped oh. up in all the fragility. So I'm uh, <laughs> having to go to Fresno to do a benefit show for a friend of mine who passed away. Um, before that, I'm going to go visit uh, Bobby Reynolds, my mentor, the person I went on the road with the first time. Uh, and I've been informed I'm not allowed to tell him that the... Uh, benefit is going on for someone that we both knew. I don't understand that, but I don't want to upset his caregiver, so I have to listen to whatever she says and say yay. Um, I worked last night. Um, near the end of my shift, I got called, told I had to do overtime, um, which I was like, crap, 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 I need to take a nap. Um, got home. I, I got some stuff together real quick. Um, and then my wife talked to me into taking a nap. You, you'd think I would learn that when, whenever my wife goes, come on, lay down, you need to lay down for at least an hour, I need to look at her and say, no, I can't do this. Um, two, two and something hours later, I woke up. I was supposed to leave at 12. It is now 1.39. So uh, I'm, I'm right on the, the outskirts of Bakersfield. I'm stopped at the AMPM. I filled up my gas tank. Um, here I'm hitting my zeros so my wife doesn't get mad at me for the trip. So that's done. I got myself a drink, which isn't good for me. But before I left, I did pack a little baggie. It has corn. It has uh, zucchini. Um, that's all freeze-dried. It's the stuff that my wife sells now. Um, and it's a really good snack, and I, I, you know, I really don't miss all the junk crap of getting the candy bars and all that stuff. So, it, it's much healthier for me, though, I did buy a corn dog. I don't know, I like AM, PM corn dogs. It's my weakness. So, I gotta get on the road. I will talk to you later. I'll go into more detail about my friend, uh, Tony's death, um, and all that. Uh, until then, see ya! Just, you know, business associates. Years passed when Tony moved to uh, Las Vegas, and when he did, we became closer friends at that point because he became a customer, and we did business still together. Uh, when the opportunity arose to, uh, a position arose with Hocus Pocus, and we offered it to Tony, he jumped at the chance in order to throw it at King. For those of you who know Tony well, um, I can describe Tony best as a ball of fire. He was constantly in motion, and he was like a little bandy handy. Well, this way, this way. It's like I even wore my Tony boots tonight so I could do the, some of those strong personalities, and sometimes we clash. But in the end, we always came together. Um, last year, after a period of time, where Tony and I did, didn't have that close relationship, and he used to visit, we sat down and we talked about things that had transpired between ourselves. And to his credit, being a bigger man, um, we kind of mended a fence that needed to be mended. When I found out Tony was ill, um, you, you, don't want to, you don't want to even consider the fact that he may not be around anymore. Um, and when the gates of heaven opened, there was a big round table. And at that table were all the great magicians who since passed. Blackstone, Sudini, Thurston, Keller, you name it, they were all there. And when they saw Tony, they all stood up and went like this.
one one chair at the head of the table. And that was for Tony. So that's how I'll think it's over. And I'll remember him every day. And all the nice things that he did for me. He's a kind, energetic person, and a true friend. Really? You want to see this because you still won't believe it. Because what we have here is breaking the bonds of reality. We are going to make you slightly sick, but that's okay, you'll enjoy it. Because what we have coming up here is one of my favorite acts. I've been fond of this young man since he was born. I had to, he's my brother, yes. Now remember, he got the height, I got the brains. And... Yes. This is an act that really you're not going to believe, but you're going to remember. This is definitely. He's been performing at many amusement parks, uh, Universal Studios, at Knott's Berry Farm, at Great America. He's been on uh, film. Uh, Big Fish, uh, Tough Luck. He's been uh, television programs, everything from uh, the, uh, the strip to uh, Thousand Ways to Die. Well, Thousand Ways to Die and Touched by an Angel. Did you ever get touched by an angel? She touched him. Okay, fine. He has also been seen repeatedly on YouTube and America's Got Some Talent. Because he had more than anybody else, which is why they threw him off. But anyway. I want you to meet my favorite sideshow artist. The man who knows more about sideshow than he knows about nuclear physics. Yes, my brother, George the Giant. A nail. Oh, God. And a hammer. Yeah. <laughs> you know where it's going. Okay. They say the human skull is one of the strongest bones in the body, and we're going to prove it right now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hammer this right into the skull. We're going to do it right in the center. Well, you got to look. It's not fun if you turn away. I didn't run away when you got here. <laughs> okay, all right. I'm Captain Evil. Oh, God. Unicorn. <laughs> All right, one more. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you better hope I don't sneeze. Oh, now you're on the spot. Oh. Okay, it's not that funny. All right, let's. No matter how strange you think I look, you should look at the expressions on your face. Because it's really priceless. Oh. Yeah, all right. Let's get out. You know, sometimes it gets stuck, so... Uh, you want to pull it out, you get a prize. You get poker nuggets. I know, it's a snotty joke. Okay. Ooh, ooh, one minute, one minute, one minute, one minute. Oh, I thought there was blood there, but it's not. Almost like a joke. Okay, fine. <laughs> Screw you all, I don't care. All right. tips for myself. What's going to happen is all the money I collect tonight is going to Tony. 
uh, to help take care of everything. And the way I'm going to do that is somewhere special. Push, push. <laughs> Suffer the little children. <laughs> oh no, he's got a five. Ooh, it's a five. Now here's something special about fives. It has Abraham Lincoln. So you have to turn the bill around and put it right in the back. Okay, it's politically accurate, not politically correct, okay? <laughs> I never said I was political. Come on, folks. Come on. Someone wants to get a shirt. Someone wants to... Come on up. Oh, it's a 20, so it goes on the forehead. Okay. Ready? Oh, my God. Mommy. My childhood memories. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, dig deep into your heart. Oh, you get a pen. Pull one out. It's in there. There. You, you can choose. Come on, folks. Remember, the money you spend, I don't get to have. So you know, Tony gets to enjoy it. <laughs> I'm awfully sexy. <laughs> Thank you. Come on, folks. Stable the freak. Remember, the money you spend, you won't remember. <laughs> when I do what you do with it, you'll never forget. Oh, it's another 20. Oh, I love my life. Mommy. <laughs> 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 okay. All right, folks. Come on. Anyone else?